pleasant good day to you and welcome back to another edition of the Watchman Radio Program. Uh, recorded live from the studio of Revival Time Radio, London, England. This program is all about the end times to open your awareness to the times that we are living in and to make you quite aware of the nearness of the imminent and soon coming of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. The warning, the horn is being blown to let you know that yes, Jesus Christ, he is coming back for his bride very, very soon, any time now. So we have to be in a state of readiness right now. And uh, for today's program, I have a letter from the Lord that was dictated through his uh, servant, the prophetess Susan Davis, on the 29th of last month, that is July 2000. And uh, 17. A letter from the Lord, and I'll get straight into that letter. And the title of the letter today is
there you have uh, the last letter from the law that was uh, dictated to uh, the prophetess Suzanne Davis on the 29th of July 2017. A very powerful letter indeed as usual from the Lord. And he started out by informing us and warning us that this is the time, there is a time to arise and prepare for his coming and he said quite clearly in the letter that uh, this time is now this is very important in other words not time to be preparing not time to be getting ready the time to be ready is now we are already supposed to be in a state of readiness because his coming can be at any time this is very serious no time to be fooling around thinking we have time to play with we do not have time to play with we do not have time to be doing our own thing we only have time now to be doing the work of the Lord to be living the life that he wants us to live to be walking the path that he has set us on his heartbeat is for souls and we are to be about that very mission. Souls, winning souls for the kingdom of God. Preparing others as we are, we ourselves are, are prepared for his soon coming. To fly into the sky when he comes. To be ready for that journey. Because that train only comes once. And if you miss it, you will miss it all. If you miss the departure of this coming train, the rapture of the bride of Christ, you would have missed it all. Uh, gladly there will be one hope left if you are able to make it through that uh, period of tribulation. Yes, there will be hope yet to get to heaven, uh, but you, you are not guaranteed that you will be able to stand what is about to come. It will be a time of great pains, a time of great torture like the world has never seen before and this uh, is laid out in scripture as well. So I'm not just saying it for saying it, for saying it's sake. The Lord has shown me in various dreams uh, things that will be happening. And the world has never seen the, the atrocities, uh, the wickedness, uh, uh, and uh, the, the, the severity of, of the plagues that will be coming on the world during this time of tribulation. So you think you want to be there, you do not. Because if you miss the rapture and you end up in that period, you will wish that you were never born. And if you were to even survive the, the sudden destruction that will happen uh, in, 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 in concert with the rapture, you will be lucky because so many people will lose their lives at that point and will be headed straight to hell. The fact that you missed the rapture is, 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 is a testimony of the fact that you are hellbound. So if you are to die, if you were to die at that point, there would be your final destination, hell. So the time to be ready is now. The Lord wants us to remember to turn away from the world, to turn away from the love of the world and the things of the world and come to him. The things we uh, enjoy now from the world, they are only temporary, they, they, they will only last for a time. But the Lord wants you to turn to the things that are eternal, the things that will last forever. So just open your hearts. Think about these things. 
And remember what the Lord is saying here, to turn and to come to him because the time to be ready is now. Not later, but sometime in the future, but the time to be ready is now. So take this word very seriously. If you have never uh, taken any word of the Lord seriously, take this one very seriously because it is a very serious word. Because tomorrow is not promised to you or to any person in this world. He can come at any time and you yourself can die at any moment. So that is the warning and the letter from the, uh, from the Lord for today's program. And I just want to thank you for taking the time to, to watch and to join me today. And as usual, if you would like to contact me for any further questions or comments, you're free to do so. You can search for me on Facebook by searching for my profiles, Curtis Minister Roach or Minister Curtis Roach or the, my page, uh, The Watchman Radio Program. You can leave your questions or comments there and I'll be able to respond uh, at my earliest uh, convenience. I would also uh, encourage you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You'll see the link at the, the bottom right of your screen. Uh, you can click on it and subscribe. That way you will be notified of uh, every time that I upload a video in the future. There are hundreds of other videos there for you to, to see and to share with your friends. As, and you can also follow me uh, on Twitter at uh, Roach underscore Curtis. Again, thank you for joining me. Uh, please share this video and the others that you, uh, you will find on my channel. They're very important messages that needs to go out to the world. Share it with your family, with your friends, on your social media sites. And let uh, the word of the Lord go viral today because it is very important that we get ready, that we win souls for the kingdom of God. Thank you again. God wish you bless you and see you next time if there is a next time. Bye-bye.